So I'd like to ask Paul Burge to come up. We've asked Paul to speak to us just for uh, very briefly uh, because November, as you know, is Stewardship Month. <clears throat> Last week, Father Micah spoke to the kids a little bit about the, the gospel reading of the rich man and Lazarus. And then this week, we, we see in the Good Samaritan uh, Christ promising to repay his church uh, for all that they do to care for those who are sick and wounded by sin. So, continuing with this theme of stewardship, we thought we'd hear also from some, some of you uh, to talk about your experiences with stewardship in the church, to give us an example and an inspiration. Thank you, Father. Good morning. I grew up going to church here and have been participating in the stewardship program for the past 10 years. <clears throat> When I was younger, I would hear about stewardship. I remember putting a couple of dollars from my allowance in the offering, but I didn't fully understand the importance of stewardship. When I got out of college, I remember sitting in church on Stewardship Sunday. I remember Tommy Yearout giving a great talk on stewardship. In true Tommy fashion, he told the congregation, you're giving, you're just not pledging. Those words stuck with me, and I began to realize how important it is to not only support the church, but to make a pledge, no matter the dollar amount. The church relies on the stewardship budget, and every bit helps. To me, stewardship is vital to the church. The Greek Orthodox Church says that an Orthodox Christian steward is an active participant in the life of the church. It comes in the form of time, talent, and treasure. We have a great community here in Birmingham, and have wonderful people who give, give to the church in a variety of ways. So I want to encourage anyone who is already pledging to continue that commitment. Lastly, I want to encourage those who are already given to the church in so many other ways to consider making a stewardship pledge for the upcoming year. Thank you for your time. God bless. Thank you. Uh, we have... 